morning people and welcome back to my channel it's China Doll so today is August I forgot what day it was August 26th and they are doing a pass full of previews for the tribute store so every season they always have something new going on whether it be for Mardi Gras, for Christmas, Halloween and it's always very well themed so I'm really excited to see what urgent stuff they have inside there but that doesn't open until 1 o'clock this afternoon so I'm gonna head over to Islands first and maybe grab on some rides and then walk over to Universal side and go check it out and let you, and bring you guys along with me um, I gotta go get my coffee fix every time whether I'm in the park before the park but yeah, and I even got the corporate t-shirt for the tribute store that I'm going into later on. So I'm going to meet up with my brother and friends and I'll see what we're going to get to. Okay, I'm going to be walking through this entrance, just cutting through so I can get to the entrance of the coaster because my friends and my brother are already there. And I haven't rode that in a while and it's like my favorite ride here. It's actually the best coaster out of all of them that they have here at Island So <laughs> Might as well go ride it and then head over to Universal. I line up for the tribute store and I also like how they have this little um thing right here so in case like people ride over it and like stuff fall out whether it be glasses or whatever or stuff right here this part right here the drop hat look at them falling down right now Woo! Whee! Whee! <laughs> except my friend Thomas over here he can't, he can't do coasters so he was the bag holder guy <laughs> but I can't do coasters Hagrid's is a coaster no. tell the truth China doll. Uh, no that is a coaster so just and, because it's your speed exactly <laughs> one day yeah. one day I'll go up there but not now <laughs> When they went what? Yeah, I know, right? There's like a 60 year old woman that was on there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm only 10 years away from it. So, how do you guys like the back row compared to the front? Uh, Let felt it more on the back row. I was out of my seat for the majority of the time. <laughs> the little rest was hard. Was, um, <laughs> holding me in uh, the front row though you get to see everything more but you definitely feel a lot more in the back what about you mike what I do you give think? the edge to the front row just because you can see everything the view when you get to the top of the hill and yeah. you look to the right you just see the whole park it's just amazing so front edge front wins but i love the back too there you go guys so let me know in the comments below what do you prefer more front row seats or the back row of velocicoaster and, and china doll <gasps> How do you like We're it? Vlog back row? I'm vlogging and he's recording. Front row or back row? <laughs> I love them both. Now taking the Magical Express. Um, so we're going to be going from Islands to Universal because it's going to be about an hour till the tribute store opens and we're really excited to go check it out. So here it comes. Okay, we just arrived. 
vibe in the King Croc station in Universal. It feels so good in here with the cool views. Are you excited for Halloween Horror Nights next week, Jordan? Yeah. So me and my brother, we're gonna be here for opening day. I cannot wait, cause you know they didn't have it last year. So I'm so excited for the 30 years, 30 fairs for Halloween Horror Nights. Who else is excited for Halloween Horror Nights this year? Let me know, are you guys planning to come the first day or what? But I just can't wait. It's like Halloween's our favorite time of the year. So here's the beginning of the line for the Passover's to go into the tribute store on August 26th. They're letting us in early at 12. The line forms here right by Rip Ride Rocket and Jimmy Fallon. So this is so cool. They're letting us in early for the line to get into the tribute store. At first it is said it was open to one, but then I asked one of the team members, she's like, oh, you can just join the line now. So the line starts here in front of the Jimmy Fallon and it goes all the way back over here. But it's not that bad and it's going, it's moving along very quickly. So we're probably gonna get in in, in a few minutes. Wow, look at this. statue and frame it matches that's pretty cool for each icon 
They got a Chucky, they got a Chucky shirt, a Chucky. Oh, well, there's Chance. So in the tribute store, I recognize some of the bloggers here. Well, there's Jack and Super Enthuse, and there's Sam being part of this position. And then there's Jen and Tim Tracker. And so if you guys were in the uh, Five and Dime store Universal, and you paid uh, to get your picture into the store, it will be in the going toward the third room against the wall. So this is pretty cool. Wow. If I recognize anybody else, have you guys seen your pictures here in the tribute store? Let me know in the comments below. So cool. <laughs> Everybody's pictures on here is so awesome. I love it against this whole wall on both left and right hand side. Look, it's Rick met up again in the trivia store. How do you like it so far? Oh, I love it. Rick, like, Did you like your picture of Matt in the back? Yeah, yeah my picture looked pretty good. <laughs> I did send my picture in with a hat on. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're now into the next like props from last year so there's a lot of people who search these saddle snacks and they got like popcorn they got blood squirty popcorn and some chocolate and some fudge basically like some of the same stuff that they had in the hollow east or islands and then they also have some cotton candy some uh, beetlejuice cotton candy this here is the carriage house collectionary and over there they have all the different like desserts The cupcakes and the brownies and the apples. So at the very end of the tribute store, they have this, the township of Kerry. Oh, I don't have a sound to go with it while you're leaving. You guys, I probably have to come back another day and refilm everything because it's like so crowded in there. I've never seen the opening day attributes to this crowd, but I guess because you know it's Halloween. But um, <clears throat> I did like a lot of stuff I say. It was just so hard to enjoy because everybody was squished in like sardines in there. Guys, in the big main Universal store at the front of the park, they have all the Halloween merch too, so you don't have to like be in the tribute store, which is more better. You have more space, you're in the AC. So they have each of these shirts that are all out right now, including the studio screamers, look at those, the, all the scare zones and icons. This is pretty awesome, even the cops. Same shirt my brother has. And then they have the Drop Dead Gorgeous shirt right here on the mannequin. All the Beetlejuice merch. Chucky. 
Ooh, I've never seen that long sleeve before. That's cool. I like how the way it looks. It's animated. Pretty much. Oh, and they also have masks too, which is great. It's like the, on the same shirt, they have the same face color. I'm leaving Universal. I bumped into Tim Tracker, Whoa. and his, him, Jen, and Jackson's picture are in the tree store. So look out for it when you guys go in. Yeah, yeah. And it's funny, my brother and Tim are having the same exact t shirts. I like this one. Twinning. Nice. Yeah. Are you excited for Halloween Horror Nights next Very week? Very much so. So excited. <laughs> like, it's great to be back, like, having a full year this year. Mm -hmm. Oh, man, I can't wait. Oh, yeah. Nice seeing you again, it's Tim. Great to see you. Okay, guys, I am going to end this day short because. That store was so crowded and I wasn't really able to enjoy it and take my time with it all. Like I said, I felt like I, I felt like I was already in a haunted house being there. Everybody's like in a Congo line, squished up. Um, but overall, it was a great day hanging out with my friends, hanging out with my brother, being able to ride Velocicoaster. And then we also did the mummy, but I'm not allowed to bring my camera on those rides. But I get to talk about it. So it was like a coaster day and it was excellent because it was short wait times which is awesome so i hope you guys enjoy this video if you do give me a thumbs up like comment share subscribe and i'll see you um actually next video next time i'm going to be coming here is first opening day of halloween horn eyes and i'm really excited so like i was saying you guys enjoy this video give me a thumbs up like comment share subscribe and i'll see you in the next adventure bye